Hi, I'm Little Fighter Extreme, and in this series, I'll teach you everything you need to know to start modding Little Fighter 2. The purpose of this series is to provide beginner-friendly data-changing lessons, because when I first studied about this, it was a complete mess. So I just want to organize things into a series that is easy to understand for total beginners. I won't teach you everything because there are some parts that are very difficult. I will just teach some basic knowledge. We'll begin slowly but steadily. After you have a solid foundation, you can start learning more advanced things on your own. I will also show how you can apply what you learn instantly, plus giving you a few homework so you can do it on your own. In order to make a mod, you need Sprite Editing Skills and Data Changing, or DC for short. I've already made a video about Sprite Editing, which you can watch here. To be honest, you don't need to know much, just some basic copy, paste, coloring, etc. and you'll be fine. So what is Data Changing? It's simply editing the data files. You open the data file with a data changer and you change something. That's called data changing and that's what you're going to learn in this series. Data changing is divided into many parts, but we only need to focus on these things because they are the core of modding. We mostly make character mods, right? I also want to talk a bit about data.txt. This is the file that the game loads. If you remove any line, it will disappear in the game. Data.txt contains all objects in the game. What is an object? An object can be a character, a ball, or a weapon. Each object has a unique ID for it. Now I'll show you some tools that you need. All download links will be in the description. What Data Changer, a program that allows you to read and modify data files. There are many out there, but I highly recommend Luigi's Easier Data Editor. 2. Dark Files Fast Load X File. Since you open and close the game regularly, this will save you a lot of time. 3. Paint.net for sprites editing. Again, we will mainly focus on data changing in this series. I also advise you to read everything about data changing on the Little Fighter Empire website. It has everything that you can ask for. Little Fighter Forever is another website, which is also very useful. It's in Russian, but you can translate it. In case you need any help, join the Little Fighter Empire Discord server and ask in the DC Questions LF2 channel. Remember to be respectful, ask clearly, show everyone what you've done to fix the problem. Don't be lazy, but also don't be shy. Your attitude in studying is also very important. You have to be active. Don't just believe what I say. Open the files, change a few things and see what happens. Just watching these videos will not help you understand anything. That's it for this video. We'll begin our study in the next one. Your homework is to have a look at davis.dat or any character you like and try to understand what it means. The first few lessons might be a bit overwhelming because they are the core knowledge of data changing. Once you get through them, the rest is pretty easy.